Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome to a Pokemon X and Y Wi Fi battle. Uh, these are less like going up any day now, and honestly, yeah. So, I'm facing Ty, who has a pretty decent team going on here. Um, it's quite a mixture of Pokemon's tiers and stuff. This is our pulley, one of the most tanks, so the slow king. So, it's probably one of the main threats, probably. Uh, bullet chat out there, that has boom boost, which I believe it does. So, right, here. You know, um, I have no idea what my weapon is about, but I'll pull it off. So, if I won, I won. If I won, you won. Because I was watching a fan, they won't you. So, uh, yeah, and apologies, there's no, like, layout for this. Um, simple because I just upload it straight from my phone. And, yeah. Pretty much, it's just easier. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoy, and I'll do my best uh, to come into your team. Right, let's go. Right, oh. I love Pingo here, it's like so amazing. Come on, Green Ninja, start off with the Green Ninja, and uh, the protein. He's like a blade who turns up with these, his art, which is definitely the Mega Region. He goes straight in for the Mega. Right there, the Mega comes straight out. I don't like the Mega. Let's go. Here's the cool man's water deoxys ball. This is so me. <laughs> it goes for the water type. Um, water type? It goes for water ball. Which didn't really do that much because, yeah. It goes for the few turn. We take a crit, which brings down 6 no health. And he instantly goes back. He sends out celery. The leaf, which yeah, I go straight for the U-turn. Doesn't seem like a ninja's but here. The celery takes a you know critical hit from this, takes a crit from it, and yeah, and so for that, uh, I switched out into Sylvian, which was kind of not the best idea in my head in my thing. Um. Let me have for your ass. It's not got high voice or anything. It's got peak sleep, but it's, high voice. it's an egg move that can't be learnt normally. So yeah, <laughs> that's why I'm running quick attack. Well, I should be running like swift or something else instead of quick attack, but we take two hits from weak blade and yeah, we're down. I sent Alan to Zippo. See, pretty darn smart to do. He was. If Drew just switched out from the Leafeon into I Need Pant, aka the Sloking. <laughs> I Mega Volt into Charizard X, if you can use why. Um, I prefer Charizard X pretty much, not because of look, just because it works better with my Charizard. At the moment, the Defender was initially for the Leafeon. But sadly not, it does a burn, so I instantly switch out. I switch out the boat into the electro, hoping to do some damage to it. It needs gold, which didn't really do that much. Just we hang in there, literally clutch, it's cold pop clutch moment. But sadly, we have burned by the gold. Um, we go in. For he was truly slow king and sent out Jackson 5, which is Buffalo. And this freaking shiny, oh my gosh, it's shiny. Pretty, I don't know, it looks, it looks weird. And it's pink. It's a pink horn, that's cool, that's cool. That's, that's really cool. Okay, we heard by Burn and yeah, it's like a little bit. Yeah. I love the low kick, but it didn't really do that much. Even if it's super effective, we took it. We didn't take more to the earthquake. And um, yeah, we we just we were gone in like fire. We we all gone. The first thing, right? So, uh, yeah, okay, right, okay, yeah, okay. Uh, I sent out into Erin, who pretty much outspeeds the buffalo and gets a hammer ramen. Takes up that in five. And um, pretty much an end for the road for you. 
Clint helped jab at you, which was kind of being helping to get away from the mud trap here. But I thought, no, because of it's being flying up, I was being really sure. So I went for the leech and instead. Even though I might have like lost Erin here, I, I switched out into. Uh, what have I switched out into? Yeah, I switched out into the green drain. We go through, we take the area yes, leaving this pretty much nearly nearly to go but we wasn't at a very right place. I go through again, here the leech had take effect, which I'm pretty glad to feel that the cube now is even better, so I'm pretty damn good, happy about it. Um, I go to the acrobatics, which was quite a yeah, not a great deal. We always took it out. If we got a crit, we would have been red, but yeah. We go to the boom burst, and yeah, we, we were done for from that boom. Um, I found out Kirito, which was alright. Speed was the sweet for the dragon horse, and we were kind of solitary from there. Uh, right, okay, so, um, he sent out, I need pants again. <laughs> I need pants. I go for the dragon pulse, because the, uh, he was just so fast and everything else like that. Um, he goes to the side shop, wipes out my Kirito. No, he doesn't wipe it out. He lost some pants with the of his life or and the burn. Which going to look at it, so if we took him in fire strike, we would have been taken out. However, uh, he sent out oh, Inferno, which I was kind of hoping to outspeed him. But now the flame tried to move fast, and yeah, we're done. I sent out Zippo because, yeah, it's still a decent Pokemon that could actually face events. In front of go for the post combat, we take it well, and yeah. I go for the fly, he goes for the home con straight after this. Which, luckily for me, we land a super effective critical hit, it's a crit for sure. And to take on the inferno, here we go, here we go, take us a crit fly. There we go. So then last of least is the is Blade, who goes for the bullet punch, which we thought would have been the end for Terra But we take it, there's like a good zip where we are, and we go for the flame charge, of course. I kind of feel bad though, but yeah. He was kind of really fresh the team, but I pulled it off in the end there. Uh, do I set out Celery, which... Yeah, of course, we're going to move the flame charge here. And that pretty much ends the battle. GG, Ty. GG. That was pretty damn close, I really must say. Uh, so, thank you guys for watching this video. Be sure to leave a like, and uh, probably even comment, or press that subscribe button for me. And yeah, that would be pretty freaking awesome. We are now at 341 subscribers. We've lost a couple, but. Um, we're getting closer and slowly to 350, so be sure to subscribe guys and I'll try to get some more stuff done, so peace out, hope you guys enjoyed it, bye!